If all days could be like today, Kurt, I'd be a very happy woman. It was very gorgeous out there. Uh, it was very beautiful today. Unfortunately, it's just not going to last. We're warming things up here in the weather department. Taking a look outside right now to trucks and extension with the uh, increasing clouds out there. Temperatures, though, 70 degrees right where we should be. Northwest winds at the uh, Meadowsfield Airport coming in at 10 miles per hour. However, uh, in the mountains and the desert, still windy up there. Wind advisory still posted until 2 a.m. Wednesday morning. Uh, after that, though, things are going to be coming down as high pressure takes hold. But outside right now, I mean, we're talking winds still in the uh, lower 30s, 30 per, 32 miles per hour there in Tashpee, 39 miles per hour in uh, Mojave. So still very windy out in the Kern County deserts up in the mountains as well. But uh, temperature-wise, we're very, very seasonable right now. Lower 70s here for the majority of the valley, 68 in Button Willow, 54 in Fraser Park, as well as Tehachapi, and 64 degrees in Lake Isabella. A bit warmer out there in the desert, 77 degrees in Ridgecrest. Skies right now in the pinpoint satellite and radar are filling up with the clouds, all associated with a uh, trough right now that's overtaking California. However, it's not going to be sticking around for very long. So we'll be waking up with a few clouds out there. However, by uh, this time tomorrow, sun-filled skies for everybody as high pressure starts to take hold. Now, this high pressure ridge is going to be uh, jetting this uh, cold front and a strong low pressure system that's in the Pacific Northwest right now. That's going to be uh, moving to the, towards the Pacific Northwest, rather, and it's not going to be giving Kern County or really uh, Central California any rain at all. So as that ridge starts to build in by Thursday, we're going to be warming things up, approaching record highs there. And the rest of the country, well, not so much. I mean, we're going to be stuck in the 10 to 20 degrees above normal sector, as well as the northwest there. They're going to be on the cold side of things as the jet stream kind of dips down and gives them very cold temperatures. So they got a bit of a spring preview. That's not going to be lasting very long, though. Outside tomorrow around the state, we're talking temperatures very warm towards Redding, 82 degrees there, 69 for San Francisco, 75 in Pismo Beach, 76 for L.A., 75 in San Diego. So a bit warmer than it was today, however, uh, it's not, like I said, it's not going to last. So here tomorrow, we're going to be expecting temperatures in the upper 70s under sunny skies by the day's end there. But uh, by Thursday, Friday, Saturday, all three days there, very close to record highs, if, if not over record highs for Friday there. Lots of sunshine on your Friday into Saturday. And then we're going to moderate things a bit there by the end of the weekend on Sunday and cooling things down kind of. But um, other than that, really uh, high pressure takes hold and lots of sunshine for the week. Tomorrow in the mountains, it's going to start off a bit breezy, and then those clouds are going to get out of there, warming things up, though, for the uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Again, this high pressure really dominates this whole entire forecast under sun-filled skies, upper 60s, though, by next week, into the Kern River Valley, uh, expecting mid-80s by Thursday into uh, the weekend. So it's a great, great weekend for a hike up there uh, if you mm -hmm. want to head outside.